Making her entrance, a new Territory Chief Minister steps up to the plate. I know it's a tough job, but I'm pretty tough. I'm Territory tough. Just three days after the shock resignation of Chief Minister Michael Gunner during a budget speech, his Health Minister has landed the top job. Arriving one by one at Parliament this morning, the Labor caucus met to vote in their new leader amid fierce speculation about who would walk out with the support of their colleagues. We've sorted this out quickly. We're going to keep our focus on the real job. The new Chief Minister paid tribute to the woman viewed as her closest challenger, Mr Gunner's deputy, Nicole Manison. We've been together through thick and thin, five babies, nearly ten years in Parliament together. The team is united and we're thrilled to have her there in the job too. A week can be a long time in politics and for Ms Files, the old saying has never meant more. When I was standing on the sidelines at soccer last week out at Bagot Oval, I certainly didn't expect the week to end this way. It's a bit of a shock, but it's an absolute privilege. She was sworn in this afternoon with caucus members present for the moment, despite the notable absence of Mr Gunner. Outside Parliament after the vote, he suggested his work was done. I had to come in today to do a vote yeah. um, and, and now making sure, essentially signing off and uh, all the best, Tash. The rest of Labor's ministry will remain in their current roles for now, with a reshuffle expected after the next week of parliamentary sittings. I fear for Territorians that for weeks we are going to have Labor members clambering all over each other, trying to work out who's going to be the deputy, who's going to get ministries and what that final cabinet shape is going to look like. As the NT's new chief minister, Natasha Files will now be forced to to deal with many of the same challenges faced by her predecessor, from protracted social issues in the NT bush to perceptions of rising crime. They're big issues and I'm determined uh, to focus on those and have those tough conversations. A new dawn for the Territory and a new leader well aware of the great responsibilities that lie ahead. Matt Garrick, ABC News.